Welcome back to my channel. My name's Penny. If you're new, it's great to meet you. And if you're an existing viewer, welcome back. Happy New Year. Happy 2024. Let's hope it's a good new good new. <laughs> Let's hope it's a good year for everybody. Um so I gotta apologize that I disappeared over Christmas, basically. I did my vlogmas i wasn't doing every day i was doing every other day i think i got as far as december the 12th and life took over um i was running around well i say running <laughs> i was going as fast as i could on my legs let's say that way <laughs> i don't run i can't run my legs don't allow me to run i got um osteoarthritis and bone on bone in case any of you are wondering if you're new but yeah I was busy with the Christmas stuff as everybody was and um, fair play to you if you're a YouTuber and you're watching fair play if you carried on with your vlogmas because I just couldn't do it guys I think I failed last year as well I did as much as I could but life got in the way uh, I just had so much to do and people to see and places to go that I just didn't have time. That's a, that's the simple fact of the matter. So we had a quiet Christmas. It was lovely. Just the four of us. The last Christmas with our eldest because she is moving into her new house very soon. At least she hopes she is. It's nearly finished. So yeah, the last Christmas as a four... I don't know what she's going to be doing next year. I don't know if she'll be coming home for Christmas with a boyfriend. I don't know if she's going to be having Christmas in her own house. I don't know. But yeah, we really enjoyed ourselves. And then New Year then, I hate. Howard isn't a fan either. So we just did our own thing, basically. Um, we did stay up. We were up until 4am, guys. 4am, <laughs> New Year's Eve into New Year's Day. How bad is that? But I, I got up then, New Year's Day, and I cooked us a full Christmas dinner again, like I always do. A New Year's dinner with all the trimmings, which was absolutely gorgeous, even if I do say so myself. Um, and now here we are into the new year. So I thought I'd give you a little update and um, show you what I got for Christmas. Now, this isn't bragging. There's nothing to brag about, guys. We're a humble family. We live within our means. Uh, well, we don't, we got a credit card, but <laughs> we live, um, you know, a, as nicely as we can within our means. So, you know, there's nothing to brag about, but I am going to show you. And the first thing I'm going to show you was off Howard. I'd spotted this. Um, it isn't a new item. It's a second hand item, but I've wanted one of these for such a long time. And I spotted it and I told Howard and uh, yeah, he got it for me. So, without further ado, I'm going to show you. I had a Cricut, guys. This is the Cricut Explore A2. This isn't the new model. There's an Explore A3 after this one in the Explore range. But yeah, it's brand new. I'll show you if I can get into it. It did come with a few bits. Let's see if I can open it. I said I've wanted one for such a long time and I am over the moon guys to actually have one because my original cricket is uh, one of the very first ones when they first came out 30 years ago <laughs> I got it off eBay and it's the one with the cartridges they use slot in and it'll only do very minimal stuff it'll only do what the cartridges allow this one I'll be able to link to Cricut Design Space on my phone and I'll be able to create also. So it came with a cutting mat, which I'm going to have to straighten out because it's bent. It's come with a few rolls of um, vinyl. It's got all the bits and bobs with it. It's got some pens with it. Now this is infusible ink and I haven't got a clue what they are. So I'm going to have to have a look at that. And then here it is inside, guys. It's all, it's all wrapped up. I don't really want to get it out because I'm not going to get it back in again. But yeah, brand new, but second hand. 
So yeah, absolutely over the moon. So look out for cricket themed videos because I'm sure I'm going to be doing quite a lot of cricket crafts. <laughs> so if crafts are your thing, stay tuned. Now I've got to get this back. There we go. So that was number one. And then to go with that, oh, sorry a minute. Go down there. To go with that, then I've got the Cricut Smart Materials Bundle. This was from Hobbycraft. It comes with all the tools, it comes with some cards, some transfer tape and four rolls of vinyl so yeah that's what i needed to get started and then i've got some books i've got the it's 2022 edition but it's the same sort of stuff it's the cheat sheets extra bonus plus it's the cricket 11 books in one so i've got everything i need to get me started and then I've also got a book on Cricut Design Space which I will be able to set up on my phone it just tells you everything it shows you how to um, how to create from your phone and then I got Cricut for Beginners it's just a step-by-step -step guide with project ideas so yeah yeah, really, really, really happy, guys. Absolutely blown away with that. Um, how I did get me some other stuff as well, which I'm going to show you in a second. Cup of coffee. Now, Howard hasn't gone out and bought my presents. It's all been online. I've pointed him in the right direction <laughs> because otherwise God knows what I would have got. He sat by there giving me the daggers. So we have got, oh, got this, which I've seen, it's um, TikTok guys, I've seen people having these and I wanted one. It's an alarm clock, it changes colour, you can have all different colours, you can have it flashing. I love it. And yeah, there's an alarm clock there. I'm just going to turn it off a minute. Go on, off you go. And it's also a phone charger. So yeah, really, really happy to have that. I've wanted one for a while. Um, again, influenced by TikTok, but yeah, I thought it looked really good. So got one of those. And I've got Stevie Nicks, the story of Stevie Nicks, the Queen of Rock. Now, you all know, if you've been here a while, how much I adore this woman. I'm absolutely obsessed with her. And, uh, yeah, i just gone a word, so I just love her. So, yeah, I can't wait to read that. I mean, I was told in my younger days that I looked like her. But I think I'm more resembler as I'm getting older and she's getting older. Talking about getting older, guys, I have a hair appointment and getting rid of all this nasty, dark, horrible, the roots, the way it's grown out. I mean, there was the original there. So, yeah, it's really grown out and I've been doing root touch-ups. So I've got an appointment on Saturday to have my hair done and I'm really, really happy as long as my hairdresser doesn't cancel because her little boy... Um, he's waiting for a date to go to America for surgery. I did share the link. I don't know if any of you saw it. Um, well, I know a couple of you did and you donated. So thank you so much. Um, they've now raised the money to enable him to go and have this life-saving surgery in America. So they are waiting for a date. And um, if, it's, if it comes this week and she needs to cancel, then, you know, of course, she's got to go and I'll have to wait. My hair comes way down the line in Kirsty's priorities at the moment because her little boy is desperately ill. If you want to follow his story, it's Caleb Orion 
on um, Instagram. Have a little look. So yeah, anyway, I digress. I was just telling you I'm going to have my hair done. I also had a book, Elvira. Who remembers Elvira? I love her. Absolutely love her. But this is um, more her life story. It's just, yeah, what she's done and... Yeah, her name's Cassandra Peterson. When she was Elvira, she looked like that. Absolutely stunning. And I just love her. She's so funny. And yeah, so I'm really looking forward to that. That's her memoirs. Then I had a new Filofax. Now, my old one was well past it. So I've got a lovely grey one. It's the personal Filofax personal, there's a little F there. And um, yeah, it's jam packed because I've got lots and lots of extra inserts and things to go with it. So I'm really happy to have that. Not everybody likes Filofaxes, but it keeps everything in one place. And I just, I love them. Then I had a load of makeup off Howard, directed by me <laughs> to go and buy it. <laughs> A lot of it, well, most of it actually, no, all of it is TikTok shop. And I'm just going to show you. So I had some Made by Mitchell Puffs, beauty blenders, some Made by Mitchell brushes. I've put them all in here. I've got all the face brushes and all the eye brushes. It's just fallen out. I'll pick that up in a minute. I've got the set of eyeliners. If you don't know who Made by Mitchell is, he's a makeup artist and he's on TikTok. Then I had a lip kit with a, a lip liner, a clear lip gloss and a brownish sort of lip colour which is really nice it's quite neutral on I really like it I'm rushing through these bits because not everybody is interested in makeup if you are I'll show you in a greater detail at a later date so let me just move all of that because I've just dropped my foundation Eey. what am I like guys what am I like oh my gosh as I'm rushing. Then I had these. These are also made by Mitchell. There's a lovely highlighter. You can use it as a highlighter. You can use it as a lipstick topper or on your eyes. And this one is a lovely gold one. Again, lips, eyes or highlight. And this one is called Penny from Heaven. <laughs> and again, it's a beautiful shimmery gold bronze and ice lips cheeks again. They're called blushes. They're multi-use. Um, they're used for everything. You can use them as cream blush. You can use them as contour. You can use them as lip colour, eye colour. They do a multitude of things. Um, they say blush, but they're not just blushes. You can use them for everything. So that was the Made by Mitchell. Oh, and I also had this lip balm. It's an intense lip balm. And it's from his new ski range. And there it is. I haven't used it yet. But I am looking forward to using it. Then I had some foundation. It's by Be Perfect and it's the Chroma colour. And there it is there. I love makeup, but I don't wear it very often. So my new year thing is, don't waste it. Don't keep it for best. Get made up every day. I had a Wonder Cream Balm. Well, it's not a balm, it's a... It's a moisturiser. Oh, 
it's sealed. I can't show you. It's just a moisturiser, guys. I don't know why it's called Wonder Cream. What does it do? Um, it's an instant glow reviver for a smoother, rejuvenated complexion. Um, it got green tea, vitamin C, niacinamide and hyaluronic acid in it. Then I had these. These are the Trigwell powder puffs and I had the big red one and the little green one. They were special edition for Christmas. So soft, so, so soft. And just a pressed powder. It was by HNB um, Cosmetics. As I said, Howard didn't go out and buy all this. I had to show him and uh, then he got them for me. It's just a fine milled, translucent, powder to be used along with those puffs to hopefully try and conceal these uh, deep deep eye troughs that I've got, tear troughs. I'm going to have another sip of my coffee a second. So that was Howard. I did well, didn't I? A spoilt brat. <laughs> He's nodding. <laughs> I'm like the kids. I have a huge pile of presents, <laughs> as you can see. Right, talking of the kids. I had loungewear and pyjamas, which I'm not going to show you because if you've seen one pair of loungewear and pyjamas, you've seen them all. But off my girls together, I had a pair of Beats Solo headphones and here they are. They are incredible. I love them. They're much better than what I was using before. They're the foldy epi ones. I love them. I really do. They're like rose gold and pink. They're so nice. They really are. So I had those. So that was a joint present off them. I'll put them away properly in a minute. Then off my eldest and her boyfriend, a joint present for Howard and myself, a ring doorbell. Now I'm only showing you the boxes, which are empty because the actual doorbell is on the door. But yeah, it took a while to work out how to fit it, how to get the alerts and stuff. Because I'm not that computer savvy, guys. I'm not tech savvy. But we got it going. So they were just the empty boxes. And as I said, that was off my eldest and her boyfriend. Then off my girls together. I'm just showing you a few little bits. Because the rest of it was like jammers, um, fluffy socks, um, you know, all that sort of thing. But I'm just showing you the bits that... I wanted to show you. So I had some concealers. Right, fine. And look at the, you open it like that. You can't really see. Look at the applicator. How beautiful is that? It's in this plastic bottle, the Lux Glass, and it's got this sort of Art Deco top. Oh, it's lush. And then it's a, a doe foot concealer. So, yeah, got those. Just love the way they look. They look so Art Deco. I'll get it done back up. Huh? Then a hot water bottle, which is still full. <laughs> but I wanted to show you, it's so soft, it's lovely. And who's on like a hot water bottle? Oh, it's lovely. And because of my fibromyalgia, this helps not only with the heat, but it helps with my back and my shoulders. So yeah, really, really lovely. Love a hot water bottle, guys. Then I've just got some bits. I'm just going to show you. 
Okay, so I've got some... Is that Plex? Yeah. Right. So I've got some Olaplex dupes. So these two were from um, Superdrug. So I've got the Nourishing Hair Mask, which was number two. She'll have to wait. And then I've got the Hair Serum, which is number five. And then I've got these two, which are from Primark. And they're the same. They're um, Olaplex dupes. And I've got the Pro Bond Repair Hair Mask, which is there. And the Pro Bond Repair shampoo or pre-shampoo treatment so you do that before you shampoo so i've got pre-shampoo two hair masks and a hair serum so god knows my hair needs it it's um treated obviously it's bleached um and i'm going as i said on saturday to have it re-blonded then whilst we were or whilst we were while she was in um Primark she picked up a load of these for me I didn't know obviously until Christmas but I know that they're Primark cosmetics so I've got the Bobby Brown dupe of the prep and protect is it protect prep and perfect um primer that's the Bobby Brown dupe then these are two face dupes. So I've got the Lash, oh, Coffee Lash Lift Mascara. Don't know why it's got coffee, it's black. Anyway, there it is. Then I've got a lip scrub. It's all two face dupes, guys. And there's a lipstick. I haven't opened them yet. When I do, I'll show you. Then I've got a contour stick, light one end and dark the other. And a lip liner and a lip gloss. Now, I kind of knew I was having these guys, I'm not going to lie, because she bought the same for herself and told me to wrap them up. <laughs> I paid her, obviously, but so I guessed that I would be having the same. Then the last few bits off the girls is a Zara Nobody Knows perfume. It's still sealed. I haven't opened this. Uh, I don't really want to open it because I've still got other perfumes on the go. But that was by Zara. And a Laura Mercier um, setting powder. So, and it's in translucent. So, that was the girls. I've got a few more things. Now, off my sister, we weren't doing big presents or anything, so I had some gorgeous pyjamas, like a teddy bear, really fluffy and cosy and gorgeous. Um, and then she did me a bag full of all sorts of things, just knickknacks, bits, um, face wipes, face masks, hand stuff. Um, it was just full to the brim of all sorts of makeup brushes, just all sorts of stuff like that that us women love, you know, just really really nice bits but then i also had and i just wanted to show you a ted baker perfume i haven't opened it so i don't know what it smells like it's called polly so that then there's these two perfumes i don't even know who they're by they're called discover and i got midnight blossom and i've got white coconut so i don't know what shop they're from even no idea but what does it say on the bottom oh that is so small i can't even see yeah they're just two little little sprays to keep in my bag so and they do smell nice and then the last thing off her and i've got greasy fingers on it is this candle 
and it smells incredible. It really does. That's just through the packaging. And inside, it's a handmade candle prepared with love. It's a watermelon, Madagascar, and it's a surprise jewellery. And I didn't know that at the time. It wasn't until a couple of days after Christmas. I wish you could smell that. It's a double wick. Oh, oh, it smells love. It wasn't until a couple of days after Christmas when I was looking at everything that I realised it's a jewellery candle. And apparently it's a piece of diamond jewellery. What's this say on there? It's a ring. So there's a ring in there, which I have to burn the candle down. I can't dig it out. I can't cheat. I have to burn the candle down to get to the ring. <laughs> So yeah, it's by Diamond Empire. There it is. Which I've never heard of before. So I'm so looking forward to... Um, they've even got... Is there a YouTube or an Instagram? They've got little um, QR codes there that you can scan and follow them on social media. What's it say? Like the Diamond Empire candle and... Adorn your environment with exquisite scent when it does, it smells lush. If you have opted for a candle with a piece of surprise jewellery, uncover it using a pair of tweezers and enjoy your wonderful gift. So I thought that was lovely, so thoughtful of her. So it seems that you can get them without jewellery or you can um, have jewellery. They are handmade. So, yeah, really, really happy with that. And it's so heavy, guys. It really is. I think it's going to take me a long time till I get to the actual jewellery bit. So I've got one more little thing to show you. Apologies for that. I know not everybody likes to watch us drinking our tea and coffee on camera, but I didn't want it to go cold. So these gifts here are off my beautiful friend, Elaine. Um, her channel is Silver Moonlight. And um, yeah, we always exchange gifts. And this year is beautiful. Well, it's always beautiful, but she got me this bracelet by J. Fee. Never heard of them. But if I can get it out. There's all the, uh, it's got a cleansing, cl cleansing, cleaning cloth, um, a guide how to look after it and stuff like that. I think there's a guarantee. And there's a little, a little written thing on the back, which I'm not going to read out because it's quite personal. But yeah, nice. Now, I haven't taken this off since I was, uh, since I opened it, since I was given it. But I've taken it off now to show you in the box. And it's an infinity bracelet. Oh, I'll just do it like this. I should have just left it on. Huh? It's an infinity bracelet and it's got little crystals on each side. Can you see? And it's got crystals going up, crystals on each side. And then it's got this chain with this little ball at the end. And you, oh my words, I can't remember which one you pull. There, you pull to shorten or lengthen. So now that I've done that, I'm not going to be able to get it back. It took me ages to work out how to get it on, but it is so pretty. And she said it was an infinity to symbolise our friendship, that we'll be friends forever. How lovely. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. I know she won't mind me showing you because we've already spoken about it and she showed on her video what I got here, so... She also got me this planner. It's a pink, um, like a faux leather. She believes she could, so she did. Because I keep banging on though. I want to get to my 2,000 subscribers and I'm still not there, guys. I wanted it for Christmas. I wanted it for New Year. I'm still not there. I'm still about 140, 140 away. Please subscribe. <laughs> 
and then inside it's um make today amazing it's just a planner and what i thought i would use it for is to plan my youtube videos because it's got sort of notes today's goals to do um it's got a weekly planner on it so it's hard it, i can see at a glance what days i'm doing what videos so yeah i'm gonna just plan everything out and uh hopefully i'll get to my 2000 and it comes with some stickers as well so if you're new and you're watching this guys please subscribe i need to get to my 2000 it's not an, it's not you know anything amazing to get to 2000 it's just my personal goal because then youtube will push my videos out more and hopefully then i'll start earning a bit off youtube because at the moment it's so sporadic like once every three months i might get 20 quid or something it's not good i need to be earning off youtube um other people can do it so i want to do it <laughs> so subscribe guys please <laughs> And a like or a comment on each of my videos would really help. It would go a long way. So she also got me these affirmation cards. They say, you got this. And they're just in a little... I can take the paper off now I've shown you. It's just these beautiful... They've got like little pink and blue designs on them. And let's just pick one out. An affirmation card a day. And this one says, make every day a masterpiece. <laughs> There's lots and lots of different words and, and quotes and things on each one. So I'm going to do one of those every single day and try and live by it. Try and follow it. <laughs> I know Elaine is very much into her cards and her... Um, she does runes and tarot and all that sort of thing and I am interested in that sort of thing but I can't do it I can't read a room I can't read the tarot cards um I just you know I am interested in the alternative lifestyle and she got me the witch's book of self-care magical way to pamper soothe and care for your body and spirit um and it's all about self-care dedicating time to yourself um, did I show you the front? Yeah. Um, dedicating time for yourself. There's one here, how to make a bath oil, um, a relaxing bath oil, a joyful bath oil, um, preparing for med meditation, um, attuning yourself with the seasons, weaving, like doing crafts, all sorts of stuff, all sorts of stuff. It's just packed with bits and bobs to help you take care of yourself, well, to help me take care of myself. So I will be doing that along with these cards and planning my videos. So guys, that was quite a long video, half an hour. Please don't think by me showing you these gifts that... You know, as I said, it was bragging or anything. It definitely wasn't. Um, I am, am, I can't speak. I am very, very lucky that I've got a lovely family who treat me. My girls treat me. Howard treats me. And um, my sister. And yeah. Oh, and I did have many of another dear friend of mine. She's also a subscriber. You know who you are. I'm not going to embarrass you by saying your name, but unless you want me to. <laughs> um, yeah, thank you. You've become such a dear, dear friend to me. As I said, you know who you are. Um, so yeah, I'm just very, very lucky to have people like this in my life. And I'm going to start crying. <laughs> And I'm lucky to have my subscribers and my followers in my life as well. You all mean the world to me. You really do. So I want to thank you for watching all my videos over the past year. I know this is a new year now, but from last year up until this point in time, thank you so much for sticking by me. I know my videos haven't always been the best. 
sometimes I wonder myself why I even uploaded them. And I know I faced troubles and I've, I faced adversity and Howard and I have both had our problems with health and finances and all sorts of things. But thank you guys for sticking by this little channel of mine. And I dearly hope that you continue to stick by me into the new year and onwards. And as I said, if you haven't, please subscribe. It would mean the world to me. So for now, guys, I'm going to say goodbye and I will see you hopefully very soon in my next video. Bye, guys. Howard says bye as well. He's waving. You going to say? Bye. <laughs> Just to prove he is there. <laughs> I'll see you all very, very soon, guys. Bye.